seven types of research gaps with examples in detail and the situation in which its application is required. Most researchers have struggled with the concept of identifying research gaps. There were no official or established framework for identifying or describing research gaps for a long time. However, in 2017, Miles suggested a model which consists of seven research gaps. Seven research gaps are Evidence gap Knowledge gap Practical knowledge conflict gap Methodological gap Empirical gap Theoretical gap Population gap Let's study them in detail. Evidence gap. Evidence gap is also known as contradictory evidence gap. This gap is caused by inconsistencies in previous research findings. A startling exemption creates an evidence gap when a new research finding contradicts widely accepted conclusions. It arises when study data allow for conclusions in and of themselves but are contradictory when considered from a more abstract perspective. The process of identifying contradicting evidence begins with an examination of each research area. The findings of these analyses must then be combined in order to uncover contradicting evidence. Knowledge gap. Knowledge gap is also known as knowledge void gap. The knowledge gap is a common gap in previous research. There are two conditions in which a knowledge void might exist. First, it's possible that the actual field lacks an understanding of theories and literature from related research fields. Second, it's possible that a study's findings are different from what was predicted. Practical Knowledge Conflict Gap Practical knowledge is known as Conflict Gap Action Knowledge Conflict Gap. This kind of gap serves as an inspiration for new research in the field. When an expert behaves differently than what they propose, a practical knowledge action knowledge conflict results. In this situation, the purpose of the research might be to determine the scope of the conflict and its causes. Empirical gap. Empirical gap is also known as evaluation void gap. This kind of gap addresses gaps in previous research. This gap relates to study conclusions or claims that need to be assessed or experimentally confirmed. For example, concerns that no study has clearly attempted to examine subject or topic from an empirical method are frequently addressed by the empirical gap. Theoretical gap. Theoretical gap is known as theory application void gap. This gap deals with the gaps between theory and earlier research. For example, a gap conflict might exist if different theoretical models are being used to describe the same fact or phenomena much like a methodological gap conflict. Scholars could evaluate which of those theories is more superior in terms of the gap in the existing body of knowledge. When analyzing previous research or phenomenon or fact, theoretical gaps are frequently used. Methodological gap Methodological gap is known as methodology void gap. A methodological gap is the kind of gap that addresses the contradiction that arises as a result of the methodology's influence on study findings. This gap examines the issues with the research methodologies used in the earlier studies and presents a brand new research direction that deviates from those research methods. It is emphasized that it may be beneficial to use a variety of research methods particularly if particular study topics have been investigated using a single or common method. Population gap. Population gap is also known as under-researched subgroups gap. It is a common gap discovered by researchers. There are always populations that are underserved and understudied. This gap is a type of population-related research 
population such as gender, race and age that is either not well represented in the evidence base or is under researched. Research gap types and the situation in which this application is required. Evidence gap. Study results are incongruent and do not support conclusions in their own right if seen from a more abstract perspective. Knowledge gap. Desired research results are not available. Practical knowledge conflict gap. Professional behavior or procedures differ from research conclusions or are not investigated by research. Empirical gap. Empirical testing of research conclusions or hypotheses is required. Theoretical gap. To develop new insight, theory should be applied to specific research problems. A gap exists because there is a lack of theory. Methodological gap It is important to use a variety of research methods to produce new insights or to prevent inconsistent results. Population gap Research pertaining to the population that is not sufficiently represented or under research in the evidence base or earlier research. Steps to write research gaps in your research. Number 1. Discuss some of the previous research. You must first mention some of the earlier research in the literature that does not address the specific topic of the research before you examine the gaps in the preceding literature. The contribution should be related to the already identified contradiction gaps and issues. This is the format for discussing previous research in your article. Number 2. Identify important gaps. The next step is for researchers to pinpoint any significant gaps, contradictions or controversies in the literature. This helps to demonstrate the need for more investigation into the subject matter. This task may be completed in a timely manner. This is the format for identifying important gaps in the article. Number 3. Write concluding statement. The researcher must also clearly express the objective of the manuscript that he is writing as well as the contributions it makes to the body of knowledge. The statement that identifies gaps, contradictions or arguments in the literature should flow logically into this statement. This is the format for writing concluding statement. Thanks for watching this video. Comment, share and subscribe.